First time I played, thought you know, was obviously that was a big highlight just in my life and my career. It was the introduction to the Marvel universe, and then yeah, I'd say for Ragnarok was it was a whole different tonal sort of shift for me. And then working on these two films in particular was such a nostalgic sort of feel. We knew it was the combination of 22 <laughs> films, so it was pretty amazing. My favorite fan interactions that I've had while now that I've played Ant Man, without a doubt, have been with kids because kids, you know, they tell you exactly what they think and when they are excited about meeting, you know, these uh, superheroes and some of the Avengers, it's, uh, it's just so joyous and, uh, and, it's a re and it's a really, really nice experience. They, it's been with kids, 100%. I mean, the biggest challenge, obviously, is just making sure that the story <laughs> is as compelling and that it, it's a fitting conclusion to 10 years of, of uh, storytelling. So you know that that's the focus. That's been our focus over the last uh, a few months is just making sure that uh, that the that the story is as complete as it can be. I can't really elaborate on Avenge of the Fallen because it probably is too. I'd be giving too much away, but I can certainly say I was like somebody asked me, well, what does the Avenge of the Fallen mean to you? And I was like, make right by a wrong. I don't know. It's hard to put it into words without giving everything away. It's amazing, it's incredible, I, you know, I can't, I'm so happy to be back. I have three words for you. This is nuts. I feel it in spades, this is incredible. Get yeah, cut myself! Oh my god! As much as you get from watching us in these films, we get from coming here and seeing your appreciation. So, thank you, thank you. I love all the costumes. Thanks for all the passion, Thanos. Thank you. I love the company I'm in, and we love you. And, and thanks again. Uh, I'll personally dedicate Endgame to you, Korea. This is for you.